because you're out here with your guys so much. So uh, just being able to suit up and be around the guys and uh, get some reps in individual has been huge for me. I noticed you would go out there like the first play of the series. You would, out, you would be in the huddle and then you'd run off. you just trying to hear the calls and kind of get ingr back, back ingrained in it like that? Yeah, Lou always says something. We gather um, at the numbers and take the field as a defense, and I just wanted to be a part of that. Uh, not miss a beat. Plus, it's fun. Um, so, yeah, have fun with it. How did you think the defense looked overall today? I think that looked really good. I thought uh, defensive line played really well against a dynamic quarterback. Um, got some big stops. Uh, I think that, you know, overall we got a lot to work with. You're missing time during training camp. Do you pay attention to, to position battles and roster battles? Are you like us in that way, <laughs> monitoring huh. it a little bit, or is that different? Uh, you know, I'm always just tuned into what's going on in the locker room, watching everybody. Uh, I think everybody as players is smart and knows what's going on, but uh, it's not my place to speculate or anything like that. What do you do to, to stay fresh during those three weeks? Like you said, it felt like a whole season that you were out. What were, what were you just trying to do to keep your mind sharp and get through it? Yeah, you get in here early, rehab, uh, get extra lifts in. Um, still, still in meetings, back doing walkthrough, getting all the mental reps, and then uh, when it's practice, doing whatever I can, whether it's cardio or whatever my body's allowing me to make sure I'm, you know. When I do come back, I'm not from ground zero. I want to hit the ground running. Uh, like today, just did conditioning after position work until uh, I can take the next step. But training Nick Cosgray, the uh, head athletic or uh, head physical therapist, and Matt Summers are awesome. They do a great job. Hard to stay patient. Yeah, but I, I have fought uh, nagging injuries my whole career that, uh, you know, I've learned that this early in the season, it's smart to take care of things. And, um, you know, you gotta, you gotta be smart. It's a long season. There's no point in rushing things. Um, I think aspects of it are, I think we always got things to work on, but I think that uh, Geno Stone, having Vaughn back, seeing Dax really develop and find himself at corner. Uh, a lot of great things are going on that I love where we're at. How have you seen Dax grow? I think he's, uh, first of all, you see him making plays. Uh, he's going about his business very seriously, very professionally. Um, it means a lot to him. And, you know, he's forming his routine, uh, just being a pro in every aspect. And that shows that, you know, that shows growth. Zach Moss, yesterday Sam said that one of the things he notices about the defense in practice is all of the different looks and the versatility you can show another offense. He sees it. What does that mean to you? Um, you know, Lou always says, you know, you have to think. Um, you have to be a smart player to play in this defense. And uh, I think it provides an advantage to us to understand the grand scheme of what Lou's calling, why he's calling it, and I enjoy, you know, being cerebral out there. I think it's playing the game at a high level and how it should be played. So, all right.